the projectors and TVs inside your classroom can use the classroom computer to display two different images. To understand how this works, imagine a desktop computer hooked up to a second monitor. Applications and documents on one screen can easily be dragged to another screen to allow you to group types of work on one screen at a time. Inside your classroom, the first monitor is set up and labeled as PC Main, and the second monitor is labeled as PC Extended. Though your classroom might have more than two screens, the classroom computer can only duplicate those two video options. So, PC Extended or PC Main may be running on more than one screen at a time. Keep in mind, anything displayed on the projectors or TVs in your classroom will be visible to your in-person students, but only shared content will be visible to your remote students during an in-person hybrid course. With this in mind, the easiest way to control your room is to set things up so that shared content is always displayed on the PC main screen and that videos from your remote students' cameras are always displayed on the screens in your room set to PC extended. To do this, start by using the touch panel in your classroom to identify which screens are set to PC main and what screens are set to PC extended. Then, on one of the screens displaying PC main, Launch Canvas and load the Zoom link on your left navigation. Find the meeting for your class and launch that meeting. Connect to your audio in the meeting and check your audio settings by clicking the small arrow next to the mute icon. Make sure your speakers are set to Extron and that the microphone is either set to USB or Samson. Most of the time, these things will be preset for you. Turn your video on and then select the recording icon to make sure you start a cloud recording for your meeting. Next, gather the files, websites, videos, or applications that you plan on sharing with your remote students and put them on the PC main screen. Once finished, go back into Zoom and click the Share Screen button. From the menu that appears, select Screen 1 and then press the Share button. The shared content you wish to share will now be displayed on the PC main screens. Move your cursor over to the PC Extended screen and click the Full Screen option on your Gallery of Student Views in the top right hand corner. You'll now have the gallery of your remote students on PC Extended. This setup, with the shared content on PC Main and the gallery of your students on PC Extended, should be your default state. You can easily change what is displayed on each projector or television in your classroom by using the touch panel to change a screen to PC main for shared content or PC extended for the gallery. As we move through the rest of this training, we will always refer to this as the default state and often ask you to start here before moving into more complex topics.